Hello everyone, welcome to Mid Smashers. Today I am gonna talk about tear film. So let's start. In front of cornea there is a thin layer of fluid which is known as tear film or precorneal tear film. There are three layers from outside to inside. You can remember this by the word lamb. L A M Lipid, aqueous and mucinous. Now I am going to show you a picture of tear film. You can see three individual layers from this picture. From the outside it is lipid layer and this is aqueous layer and this is mucinous layer and there is corneal epithelium. I have made many ophthalmology videos. You can see the videos. I will put the link of the playlist in the description box. Now I will discuss each layers. The sources and the functions also. First the lipid layer or oily layer. It is the outermost layer and adjacent to atmospheric air. The sources are membomian gland of tarsal plate and gland of G's which is the gland of eyelid and the functions are prevents evaporation of aqueous layer and it also increases surface tension and prevents spillage of tear. Now the aqueous layer. The sources are lacrimal gland and accessory lacrimal gland. From the lacrimal gland the formation of tears occur. The functions are keeps cornea and ocular surface moist fills irregularities in cornea if there is present any irregularities then removes foreign body or debris gives nutrition to cornea it contains some antibiotics and antibody which act as an antimicrobial agent so it protects our eyes from the bacteria also so now there is uh, another layer which is mucinous layer the source is goblet cells of conjunctiva it confers hydrophobic corneal epithelium to hydrophilic state and it also causes lubrication. I hope you have liked this lecture. If you like it then give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I also have an Instagram account. I will put the link in the description box. Thank you everyone. Bye.